Hey, how's it going, guys? We just scored, absolute score, as much of a score that could be a score. We just got a Mario Kart Wii, uh, still sealed in the original packaging. Uh, super cool. Um, and the best part is I only paid $10 for it. Yeah, absolutely insane. I can't believe I picked that up for 10 bucks. The girl marked it sold right away and uh, she left it outside for me. I don't know how you buy a Mario Kart Wii and not open it because that's like the best game on the system. But yeah, definitely not complaining because it, it worked out well for me. And uh, yeah, gonna add that to the collection. This is actually my second uh, sealed Mario Kart I have. I picked one up maybe in like episode like 10 or 11 a few months back. And uh, yeah, super stoked about that. I paid $10. It's probably worth close to like 100 and it'll only go up in value. I'm holding on to all my sealed games because they just keep going up and up and up in value. Um, like one day, this will probably be worth like $500 uh, sealed. It's not today, but maybe one day and stuff like that. But yeah, $10 for a sealed Mario Kart. You definitely can't beat it. And she was a little far, like 15, 20 minutes, but I think it was definitely worth it to get a $100 game for 10 bucks. And uh, yeah, the seal is super clean on that. I'm super stoked with this. And and uh, yeah, guys, let's keep it going. How's it going? Not too bad, not too bad. So I wasn't sure if that was you or not. My apologies. Um, cool, cool, cool. There's 10 for you. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you. You as well. Hey, how's it going guys? Just a little pickup, but a big pickup at the same time. We got Silent Hill Downpour. Um, about a $70, $80 game. I will throw up a sold listing. Um, it is complete, but I got super lucky and I only paid $10 for it. Like absolutely insane. Um, she posted a bunch of games. Uh, she wanted five, $10 each and she didn't say which were like priced at what. So I just messaged her. This was the only good game there or else I would have got something else. But I just messaged her and I said, how much do you want for the Silent Hill? She said, it's 10 too much. I was going to offer five, but I was like, you know what? It's already a good deal. You know, like just take it and like go kind of thing. But uh, yeah, so she she said 10 bucks. I said that was cool. She like changed the listing. She like marked it. She went and like put like an X through it so you couldn't see it. Um, awesome. Love it. And uh, yeah, going to be adding that to the collection. I do already own it, but I feel like this game is just going to go up and up. That seems to be a trend with the Silent Hills. But uh, yeah, guys, super happy with that. And let's keep going. Hey, how's it going? Not too bad. Sorry about him. <laughs> yeah, there's 275 for you. It all works okay and stuff like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. no, I just, uh, I just don't have to use it anymore. Okay. You just never know if it's a place. <laughs> Hi, buddy, how's it going? Okay, so it's a free controller. One doesn't have thumb pads, the oldest one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I figured in a picture. The gray one I bought last year works okay. good. Cool, that's the one I wanted the most. So cool. And then there you go. Awesome, cool. Sweet, man. Thank you so much. No problem. I appreciate it. You as well. Hey, how's it going, guys? We just picked up another PS4 Slim bundle. We've been picking up a lot of PS4 and Xbox Ones lately. They've just been selling really well for me, and they've just been really quick, easy flips, as long as everything works, of course. But yeah. Okay, so I paid $275 for everything you're about to see. Not the best deal in the world, honestly, but the guy was willing to bring it to me. And I was kind of just in a buying mood. Like I've just been kind of all about the uh, wheel and deal lately. And uh, 
some some months i try harder than others to like acquire inventory and you know make money and stuff like that but yeah right now i'm definitely on that i'm definitely trying to make as much money as i can even if i have to put out a lot of money uh if i know i can make a profit i will do that and if i know i can do it quickly we paid 275 we'll get 200 back just on the ps4 my amazon guy is coming tomorrow to buy this so super cool it is the one terabyte and then it also came with three controllers um one being just the normal black we'll get 50 for that so that'll put us at 250 we just have to make back 25 and then uh it came with another controller uh but the it's in really good condition other than the rubbers are missing like the buttons all work good everything like that but for some reason i don't know if you like something happened to the rubbers but we'll get like 30 35 for that because it is in really good condition um other than the rubbers it does work really well so yeah Right there will already be in the profit, and I didn't have to do a thing. And then it also came with uh, two games, NHL 20 and NHL 2K18. Uh, Not really worth anything. I'll probably, you know, bundle them together for like 20 bucks or something like that. And then it also came with like two of these long, like, charging cables. Always nice to have. Kind of cool. And then I am going to be keeping this for the collection. It's this nice gray uh, PS4 controller. Uh, really cool. He even said that he like just bought this or whatever. But I am going to be adding that to the collection. It is in really good shape. So uh, yeah, like I'm not going to be selling it. But if I did, I'd probably get like 50 or 60. So yeah, we're not going to make a whole lot of money. If I were to sell everything, I'd probably get like $75, $80. But the $80 I'll get will be like a really easy one. So uh, yeah, nothing too crazy in this one. Just a quick little PS4 pickup that the guy brought to me. Didn't have to do any work for. Have my Amazon guy coming to pick up the PS4 to make most of our money back. And then I just have to sell like a controller to, you know, be back in the profits. So yeah, super happy with this. Uh, loving the PS4s lately. And uh, yeah, guys, let's keep going. Very cute dogs though. Very yeah. cute. Hi, how's it going? Hi. Hi, my mom would love you. She <laughs> would. Oh, cool, cool, cool. It all works okay and yep, stuff like yeah, that? 100%. Yeah, 100%. Awesome. Yeah. All right, there is. Feel free to double check that before I run yeah, away. No worries. Yeah, no Yeah. Perfect. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Awesome. Sweet. 250. Yeah, I'm trying to make it easy with the 50s. Yeah, so. yeah, good. Awesome. Thank you so all much. Right, I appreciate it. Hey, right. how's it going, guys? We just picked up this awesome Minecraft edition Xbox One Slim. I paid $250. Not the best deal in the world. Sometimes, even though I am the resale wizard, I do end up paying, uh, you know, close to retail prices for stuff, you know, if I want it for my collection. But yeah, I saw it right away. I was going to try and talk them down, but I thought, you know what, $250 is a pretty good price. Yeah, I was cool with it, so I went and picked it up. It is the next day right now. Unfortunately, it is raining. Hopefully, the rain, like, noise doesn't, like, mess with the video too much because um, I really don't have time to refilm this. But uh, yeah, really quickly, we got the... Uh, xbox one s minecraft edition um it does work i did test it it also came with this awesome minecraft edition uh green controller which is super cool probably the main reason i even wanted to buy this was for the controller i'm all about buying the uh special edition controllers and consoles lately especially controllers i think the controllers are awesome but uh yeah unfortunately there were two negatives with this pickup which kind of sucks because i was paying pretty close to retail especially from what i normally pay first off the controller i never have luck with controllers like literally ever in my life unfortunately like everything is good about it i was super stoked i was like awesome it's a really like perfect condition controller but for some reason when you like go down to the right on this stick and push down it doesn't like push down like it does here it clicks no problem and stuff like that but then once you get to over here it like doesn't click and there's like a piece it's not really moving around now but there was like a piece rattling inside so i'm thinking it had something to do with that where like they broke off a piece inside and that's why it doesn't click down properly but yeah super bummed i might end up selling that i'm not sure what i'm gonna do with that because yeah it's like one of the green thumbsticks too so it's not even like I don't even know if I could do like a shell swap or something like that because um, it is the uh, joystick. But yeah, super bummed about that. I really, really wanted that. And then the only other negative is like the Xbox works, but I don't know what was going on right there. There's like a chip missing on the corner there. And then it's like, it's really hard to see, but it's like popped off right there. If you guys, maybe that's a better angle. But yeah, right there is like kind of popping off and like kind of like bent. I don't know if they like melted it or something like that. I don't know what happened there, but yeah. So I am going to add this to the collection. I am still super stoked about it. I'm happy to have it. It is in pretty good condition uh, otherwise. And I mean, I probably won't use the controller because it is, it does work like 
95% well, but the 5% that it doesn't work, um, it would just drive me crazy um, to use it. I was going to take it somewhere and maybe try and get it fixed, but I don't know if that's, you know, cost effective or whatever. But yeah, so that kind of sucks. So that's everything I just picked up for $250. Um, and th by the way, those people were loaded. I expected uh, their stuff to be in a little better condition because they had like probably the biggest house I've ever been to. Like, we're talking like multi millions. Like, he, he picked me, like, he didn't pick me up, but he came and got me in a go kart. And then I drove behind him to like his gated house where there's like gates that open for you. And then it's on like a lake. It's like, yeah, it was a really expensive house, really nice house. Um, you would think that the rich people would take better care of their stuff. But um, yeah, super happy with this. Got to go into the collection and uh, I will throw up my potential profit, but I doubt it'll be much because I did pay full price and the controller is a little messed up. So yeah, guys, uh, sorry I look so crazy. I wasn't really trying to film a video today, but I have no other choice. But yeah, guys, let's keep it going. Mm -hmm.